Welcome back. Today's training class is, this is the kids training class for the Kempo classes that happen at our school. These are to be done while we're not at home. I know I jumbled that, it's okay. Again, we want you to share these videos with anybody you want. Everybody can use it. Anybody can train with, along with it. As long as you're doing that work at home, show us that it's going on. Send us a video back, just little clips of you doing the work or even just pictures of you doing the classes so we can find a way to keep in touch. Again, Mr. Cooley, you're gonna come out. I'm gonna have you stand on this side for me today. Okay. We're gonna stand right here. I'm gonna back up in the right place. We're gonna start our class. Hands up. And back up. Start to do some pepper jumps to loosen up the body, just nice and relaxed, staying calm. As you're doing these, I want you to focus on breathing in and out without letting it get fast paced. So try to control where your breath is right now. I have to make it loud so it's here. Yeah. And hands on your hips, feet apart, roll your hips around in circles. Again, keep that breathing soft and calm. Other direction. And shake out the arms just around for a little bit, loosening them up. Other direction. What I want you guys to do is reach your hands up really, really high and lean back. And move off to the side and the other side. And drop them, shake them out. All right, getting into that square horse stance. Our first drill today, we're going to start in pieces and we're going to build something. We're going to start by turning our body, punching to the side, turning back the other way, and punching the side. That's just our first start. So I'm going to say hit, turn, punch with a good strong key eye, but holding it there. I'll say hit again, turn, punch to the hit. other side. And every time I say hit, we just turn and punch. Hit, 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 hit. Now, we're going to change that and go to something else. We're going to put one hand elbowing across and the other hand doing uppercut in front of us. So two things happening at once, elbow, uppercut. Then we're going to turn it around, elbow, uppercut. Again, elbow, uppercut, elbow, uppercut. So Kia, nice and strong. Hit, 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 Keep those dances low, don't let them straighten out. Hit, hit, hit. Now let's combine both of those together. We're going to turn and punch to the side. This hand that's out will become the elbow and the other hand throws an uppercut. Now we have to turn to the other side. Punch here. This hand that's out becomes the opposite elbow. Turn for the uppercut. So it's two hits. I say hit once. You're going to go punch, elbow, uppercut. Then we're going to call hit again. Punch, elbow, uppercut. So let's try this out. Hit. Keep that coordination going. And hands and feet. Shake it off. Shake out your hands. Dropping into that fighting stance, right leg back. We need to use our legs a little bit. We're gonna combine three kicks. We're gonna go front kick, put it all the way back down behind us, wheel kick, bring it all the way back again, and then side kick, and now we're gonna switch to the other side. We're gonna do this going quickly. So it's front kick, as soon as the foot touches, it does the next kick. As soon as it touches, it does the next kick, and then we'll back in the other side after the third kick. So again, front kick, wheel kick, side kick, as soon as your foot touches the ground, do the next kick, and when you switch to the other side. Kick, and return. Other way, kick, front, wheel, and side back to your spot. Kick, front, wheel, side, and return. Kick, front, wheel, side, and return. Kick, front, wheel, and side before return. Kick, front, wheel, side, and return. I think I switched to a little forward. Hands and feet together. From this drill, maybe step off the side too. Get down into a push-up position. You're gonna turn your body first, reach one hand up, and reach the other, oh, I fell. Reach the other leg up, and come back down. Turn the other way, hand up first, leg up, and back down. Hand up, leg up, and return. 
Hand up. Ooh. Keep that balance. Leg up and return. Hand up. Leg up. And return. One more time. Hand up. Leg up. And return. And sit back up. Go back to the I'm going to have you do this next drill. You're going to sit down in a sitting position, crisscrossing your legs. Your exercise here is just like the technique sitting defense. You're going to use your body's momentum to lift up, followed by a chicken kick, land back in a stance, and sit back down after you're done. I will say go. It's not about falling over. It's not about getting it perfect. It's about trying with your best effort to see how, how you can move in control the whole time. Again, jump up, chicken kick, land in a stance. Go. Chicken kick, land in that stance. And sit back down. I'm going to give you guys a little bit of time at home to reset. Find your positioning. Use your legs to push your body up. If you need to use your hands to assist, that's okay to start. The goal in this is to not use your hands at all and just use your legs. And one more time. Actually, two more times, so I'll call it now. Again. Go! Up. Chicken case. Land at stands. Sit back down. Go! Up, chicken kick, and swing. Land back in your stance. Very good. Thank you, sir. I'm going to have you stand on this side. We're going to face the side now. I'll have you move over on one There you go. We're going to start something with our front leg and our front hand following with our back hand. The front leg is going to do a side kick. As it comes down, that front hand is going to do an elbow, and our other hand is going to do a cross. That's the entire accommodation. Side kick, elbow, cross. Hit. It's not a race, just get the movement. Hit, side kick, elbow, cross. 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 One more time. Hit, side kick, elbow, cross. And now we'll switch sides. You can turn in another direction, we're just making sure you can see what's going on. Again, front leg, side kick, plant it down, elbow, backhand, cross. Hit, side kick, elbow, 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 cross. One more time. Hit, side kick, elbow, cross. That was fun. Hands and feet together. <laughs> For this portion, Mr. Cooley, I'm going to have you step up here. We're going to get into a fighting stance. The measurements we're going to look for, his front toe is on the same line as his back heel. We're going to keep our feet in that front toe rear heel line so we're nice and solid. You're going to bend your knees. The drill is a jump and a controlled landing. So I'm going to say go. You're just going to jump up with your arm, switching to the other side, and your aim is going for that front toe and that back heel on the same line again. Once you get there, check it and drop low. So drop low, drop low. I'll call go. He'll show you when the jump happens. I want you guys to check it at home. Mom and dad, make sure their lines are straight and not crooked and zigzagged. Ready? Go! Get that toe heel line going. Bend your knees. Bend your knees. Go! Toe heel line, toe heel line. Even lower, even lower. Did you get it? Make sure we have some photos of you guys doing this at home. Ready? Go! Drop down. Get that knee nice and deep. Again, go! Switch to the side. Front to rear heel line. And one more time for everybody. Go! Good. Front to rear heel line. That's the drill we want. Once you check it, keep doing that until you can land without having to adjust your feet. Thank you, sir. Hands feet together. All of these things are drills that we expect everybody to do the best they can. Try it with your best effort. Show us your best effort. It's not about being perfect. It's about doing the training. Hands up. Feet together. And train with passion. Train with passion. No, you can do louder. Train with passion. Train with passion, Very sir. Nice. Thank you, sir. Back up there. Again. Share your videos with the school. Share your pictures with the school. Show us how excellent you guys are acting. Showing that black belt attitude while working at home. Keep it a good job, guys.